and welcome to the show you're watching game crossroads my name is levi and we're back to playing some dauntless uh over the week since the 20th it's now the 27th there was a double xp weekend and i went from well level somewhere between four and six where we ended off and i'm now level 50 i may have over grinded this game a little bit but that's fine now we don't have to sit through all that grinding so Frank is joining us today, so I'm going to invite him to the party, and Radish is joining us today, so I'm going to invite him to the party. And as usual, Frank will be silent, because uh, he still doesn't want to be voiced on the cast, but Radish has decided to join me today in the, in the live chat. Yes, the live chat. There he is. <laughs> uh, if he's too quiet, just let me know. I can pump up his audio a bit. Uh, and of course, you can always join the live chat. There's two empty spaces, but uh, we'll have to leave one available for Frank in case he wants to join. So, just gonna double check the live stream's running properly. Looks like everything's going just fine. So, yeah, Frank and Radish are both in the group. We can start whenever you guys are ready. Frank will, of course, be using the stream chat to communicate, uh, so. All right, Frank's ready. We're gonna do an escalation, is everyone okay with that? Escalation sounds good. Escalation sounds good, all right. Escalation I'm one. Be using, I'm gonna be using the repeaters instead of the ax like I normally do. All right, yeah, that's fine. I'm fine with that. I just realized, uh, it's basically uh, our entire team from back at that sidestep episode we all did together. I can't remember which sidestep episode that was, but we played Dauntless for two hours as an as a old sidestep. We did. Yeah. So we just gotta wait for the mission to start. I should probably equip my favorite outfit right now just with how I've set it up which where is it wait where is it oh there it is it's behind the chat just gonna equip all the pieces to this Yeah, Montana, uh, we got Radish joining us again. He joined us back when we first played this game as a sidestep episode, and he's decided to join us again for an episode of MMO Mondays. He's a little quiet. Okay, let me just... Well, I, I haven't I... been talking much, Yeah. But I don't know if this is quiet or not. Oh, that's fine. I just, I just pumped up your audio like 50%. Okay. All right. Uh, oop, no, I'm not ready just yet. I need to put the pieces on my armor. Gotta get one of medic. Get some nine lives. Um, oh, what was the other one I was getting? Stunning vigor. Oh. I already have that. Actually, I'm gonna use the pike. Okay. Yeah. Go with the pike. Whatever you feel like using, just use it. Yeah, the chat says that's better volume. Stunning. Oh, yeah, there it is. Stunning vigor and a little bit more nine lives. Because why not? I like using the storm hammer, so I'm actually going to keep using that. And that should be good. All right, I'm ready. And everyone's ready. All right, cool. So I'm pretty sure everyone here has done an escalation. Radish, you might not have done one yet, but I know me and Frank did on one of the previous episodes. It's basic. Uh, I've, I've done one. Oh, you've done one? Okay, yeah, cool. So let's get right into it. Okay, so unfortunately the chat, I, I, I may have put the chat in front of the objective, which is a little bit problematic, but we'll, we'll deal with that. Oh, come on. We're just all beating on him. Oh, 
Okay, reload, reloading. He can't, he's not standing still enough for me no, to actually he's not. get any part of him. No, now he is, but I'm not close enough. Nice. What is that? Uh, probably not good. I've only, with having only done one escalation, I have no idea what that black orb is. All I can say is probably not good. Is it reaching off my health? Oh, yeah, his tail is wounded. And knock down. There we go. I'm gonna try to wound his head. Uh, never mind. Actually, I think his head is already broken. Well, he's dead, so. Can you see that? I think I actually was wounding him throughout the battle, I just couldn't tell. Ah. I have a build that makes it so that 87% of my damage is converted to wound damage. Nice! Which is actually ends up being a bad thing when the behemoth part breaks, because once it's broken, you can't deal wound damage to it anymore. But I can wound it in like three hits. Okay, I've, I've grabbed a little bit of life steal. I thought that was a good idea. Hey, By welcome the way, to the stream, seen... Extreme. If you ever see that uh, that option in the, I don't really know what that is, the crystal upgrade or whatever. If you ever see the option to get like the team fight tactics, oh where yeah, definitely. Grabs one, gains more damage. That's like the best one. Yeah, I saw that the first time I was in here and everyone grabbed it, so I was like, seems like a good idea to grab that if everyone else is grabbing it. Yeah, just this kill this guy so e Both of these are, are very staggerable enemies. I don't know what a non-staggerable enemy would be. Uh, the the porcupine enemy. The uh, Oh. He is very yes, hard to stagger because he just doesn't he doesn't have any stagger stages in his attack patterns. Oh, I think they broke his head. <laughs> yep. I, I, don't, I don't really mind the the war pike. It's like incredibly easy to use. Well, they're not none of the weapons in this game are incredibly complicated. They just have complicated okay. strategies to them. Whoop! Hey, could have rolled away from that. Ow. Okay, can we just end one of these things? Yeah, I'm trying. Preferably the Ember main. Ember main moves faster. Yeah. Okay, here he comes. No. Nope. That old song and dance, man. I am on fire, but that, that, ow, ow, I am still on fire. Ran right into a fireball. I'm gonna try and help you take down this ember main. Sounds like something from Warframe, an ember main. Well, that ended pretty quickly for the, uh, Shrike. He ain't dead yet. Don't count him out just yet. Never mind, he's dead. No, no, he's dead. Ouch! This guy's going to a bit of a rage state, but that'd be fine. Come on, come on. Ow. I don't like the part where you burn to death. That's, yeah, that's not great. I'm gonna get a bit of... either. Because it heals some of you guys. Oh, it's dead. Nice. Okay, let's go. Uh, I know I didn't turn the contrast up, so the vivid colors are always there. Might be a screen setting on your end, or might maybe I accidentally changed something on my end. Uh, it's called Squad Goals. It's called Squad Goals. I don't see it anywhere. Oh, I have it. Okay. I found uncommon, so I grabbed it. It's packed of vitality. Woo! 
Okay, who do we want to take down? Uh, I guess there's just there's one. Only one. It's just a Pengar. Which they Excellent. added. They added a stunnable phase to him. When he's rolling, you can stun him. Couldn't you always do that? I could have sworn you could always stun him. Well, they if if you could, they made it more obvious. Yeah, no, you could always stun him when he was doing that. I know that because I've done it. One part of him is going to get wounded because I am dealing 300 wound damage per hit. Ow! I am getting stunned by some sort of... That's yeah, weird. that's his little electric buddy. When did he get that? Uh, it's not really his, so to speak. It's just the, the environment. It's just, see, it says weak spot on his head, and uh -huh. shock are the modifiers for this area. Ah, okay, that's probably the part of the screen that I accidentally blocked with the chat. Oh. Because I can't, I can't see the entire, uh, the entire left, right side of my screen. I should probably put it where player health is. Yeah, I mean, I don't, well, I don't know. Maybe put it where your potions are in the bottom part, because... That might be better, yeah. People don't really need to see your potions. And I don't use potions that often. I should, should, but I, I don't. The only potion I really use, unless I'm desperate, is the health potion. And maybe my grenades. He did a little spin, but he still couldn't escape my hammer. Ah, shock mollusks. Bad. And I think, wounded. I think we've already wounded and broken his head, so I can't deal wound damage to it anymore. You know, what? I'm gonna go deal wound damage to his tail. If I can, he keeps falling over, and I can't hit him when he falls over. <laughs> yeah, I'm not doing part damage to his head, which means it's already broken. Knock him over, though. If you hit him in the head, no, nah, never mind. Oh, it's oh, dead. He's dead. Did I not take damage that entire fight? Guess not. No, I'm pretty sure I did. Must have just something healed it, and that I was not paying attention. To. Boom. Um, squad goals found it. Got it. All right, let's keep going. Let's keep this train rolling. All right. We got. Nizaga oh and Drask. yeah, Nizaga and Jurassic up here. Uh, Nizaga dies first. That's just how this works. All right. I'm drinking my. Dr oh, I'm almost dead. I started this match almost dead. Probably because he got hit by a particle beam. Yeah, this guy is way more annoying. That is a wounded head if I've ever seen one. Yeah, I'm working on it. What's great is I have a perk where if I uh, if I take damage, I gain um, vampire. I would like to leave this area of certain death. <laughs> yep. Uh, we also have Pangar Exploders running around. Well, that's even worse. Pengar? No. Whatever. Uh, Boreas. Yeah, Boreas. We just fought a okay. Pengar. Yeah, we did. Oh, no, no, no. Ow. Would you stop running around? I'm trying to smack you in the head. Okay. Back legs will do. Yeah, see? Told you they do. The amount of wound damage this thing deals is ridiculous. I am hitting him for like 600 all wound damage. <laughs> wow. That's actually a lot of wound damage. He's either charged. Break that. Break those spikes. Ah. Uh, right. I'm working on it. Oh, I'm gonna Ow. die. Okay, he's down, he's down. Oh, I died. I am also down. I'm just gonna give up. Okay, I was gonna say, I've got I've got seven levels of medic, so if you need it. <laughs> oh, I don't think it does anything over level six. No, it doesn't, but my armor does four, and I grabbed a thing that does three, so... Nothing I can really do about that. Okay, can we get rid of these spikes? Because I'm Currently, not, I don't deal much If we get rid of the Nezaga, the spikes will go away too, so that's why I'm just focusing on him. Come on, raw damage output. Let's get him. Let's get him. Nope, missed me. Okay. Raw damage output is not my forte, but sure. This is a support weapon. 
Okay, these guys are both on, on their last legs. Did I just ricochet an electric bolt to hit the side of me? Ow. Ow. Oh, he's got a wound on his arm. Try to get rid of his arm now. He's dead. Okay, that's one. Let's take down the... I was the, not the... able to get rid of his arm entirely, but, you know, whatever. Take him down. Ow. Take him down. Is, it, is that dead? I think he's dead. Yeah, he's dead. Ooh. I need Luke heal me by healing. Oh. There we go. Nice. We used, we used that glitched in our favor. Because that should have only healed us once, but it healed us twice. Nice. Was that it? Was that the end of it? I think that was the end of it. Yeah, we didn't do it fast enough to get to the last part. Oh, it's speed. But we got S's on yeah. all of them. Yeah, no, you need to get an S++ on all of them to get to that final guy. Oof. Okay. Wow. That's... Yeah. yeah. That's impressive. Or maybe there's a hero version. I don't know. All I know is that there is a thing. Like, there was another island that I could see, but I've also watched the video and it had something yeah. about, like, there's some flying thing. Well, unfortunately, I brought an electric weapon in, and those last two guys were electric. Alright, I'm gonna go charge, get like a, a lantern charge since I got enough XP for that. That was intense. That was fun though. We could also try a heroic patrol if you guys are up to it. I know Frank's actually completed a few. Clap, clap, good job. <laughs> um, fully upgraded. All slayers. Ooh, that's not bad. Executioner. Each behemoth below 50 health. Oh, oh yeah. I got no more and talent points. I, yeah, I don't have many talent points because I don't, I don't do this much. But squad goals. <laughs> yes, I've already maxed out squad goals. Squad goals is amazing. Okay, I finished. I ended up finishing four, not four, three bounties because of that. So I should have been doing that more often. Uh, I more often use blaze weapons, so I'll do that one. This one. I'm not still doing bounties, I just, there are bounties, so I might as well grab them, right? Uh, yep. I guess I might as well not hand them in until the next season, actually. They were all bronzes anyways, it's fine. I'm currently using a shock weapon, so I might as well grab that. And now I just need to move the uh, chat. Hold on. It's gotta go in here. Stream game overlay. Toggle positioning mode. Move it down there. That that will probably do. It will at least be better than it was. Uh, toggle positioning mode and open chat again. There we go. And I forgot to turn on my my buffer timer. Oh well, I guess I'll just have to keep an eye on the clock. Uh, another escalation, guys. Uh, sounds good to me. All right. Frank says it's cool as well, so let's go. Then we just gotta wait a little bit. Also, uh. Rash, I don't know if you've already done this, but I'd recommend building. You don't have to upgrade them, but just build all the weapons in every class because it gives you a lot of XP just for building towards all the weapons. What? Uh, towards your player level, not your not your season level. Okay, I'd love to, but guess what? I have no orbs. <laughs> you, no, you don't need orbs to build them. You need orbs to upgrade oh, them. Oh, okay. You just all need right. the applicable parts for each creature. All right. Maybe don't. I don't even know if I have that, oh. but I can check. I don't. You don't. Okay. No. Yeah, I had because of what I had been doing for the the seasons pass. I had a huge backlog of materials and was able to build pretty much every weapon in every class. So. You yeah, know, I've got some of them, like the basic enemies, like shrikes and cool shots and nashers. Mm -hmm. 
But I don't have anything past that, really, for basic parts. I, I've got, and I got some other basic ones, like Ember Mains and Charogs. Actually, no, not Charogs. But I don't really have that many parts. Eh, yeah. alright. Oh, and stream chat, if you notice my character looks a bit different, I decided to spice him up between streams as well. Got tired of his perfectly clean face. He, he was anime villain. <laughs> Actually, I'm not. Yeah. Okay, so the, the first modifier is weak spot. Have a conducti conducive weak spot. Conductive. I don't know where it is. It's it should show. Oh, it's on his left arm. So aim for his arm when possible. But this guy does have a relatively common. Uh, interruptible time. Uh oh. I've wounded his, um, his. Got him. Okay, something. get that arm. I wounded Why something. is he lying on that arm? Come on. Wow, what a nerd. Man, I don't Just know if it's keep hitting it. Am I the only person that can deal wound damage here? Uh, I know, not. I I know that I don't deal wound damage at all. You should really? Well, about all weapons dealt at least a little bit of every damage type. Mmm, nope. My hammer is dealing part damage and and knockout damage and neutral damage. I'm not seeing any red numbers. No, you don't see the numbers. It'll just show what you're dealing most of. Oh, okay. Well then, maybe I am. Here he comes. Oh, he usually goes for a second run at that. He does usually, doesn't he? I'm having a real tough time being where he is. Yes, uh, same here. I can't even get my pike charge up, because he just keeps moving so much. And there we go. Okay, that's another arm down. Knockout. Oh, he's just dead. dead. Yeah, he's just yeah. dead now. Alright, let's get our boosts. I took a lot of damage at that time. Like, a, a lot. <laughs> Squad goals! I don't see it. There we go. Alright, so if I dodge through attacks, everyone does more damage. Okay. Kill kill the one that we hate more first. Okay, which one is that? I'm not there yet. The quill shot. Ah, yes. Because the Skarn is easy. Skarn is like a babby. Uh-oh. I'm not dealing any wound damage to this guy. Well, just keep hitting. It's bound to happen eventually, right? Oh, okay. No, you just had to break the shards off of his what well, his body before you can wound him, apparently. Interesting. Yeah. Neat I can't wound him until he's damaged. I broke his face. Okay. He didn't seem to care much, though. I'm trying to hit his face. I'm also not a fan of attacks that can hit me twice. Okay, he's dead. Take down the scar. Oof, he's just going down. Oof. Stab, 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 stab. Stab, stab. He is not having a good day. Keep, keep preventing him from having a good day. Smackdown! Oh, it's dead. Well. Well, we got S. 
which is odd because I really thought we would have gotten more. But eh. no, I keep taking. I'm out of health potions. So. Oh, that's that could be it. I I, don't, I haven't used the pike before, so yeah. Okay, let's go. Okay, we got um, some some boomers coming in. That's a caravac, all right. Oh, hey, my weapon's oh proficient against this guy. My armor is not, though. Oh, boy, my least favorite enemy to fight. <laughs> yeah, I'm not exactly a fan of this guy, either. I'll be completely honest. Ow. Ow. Ah! Hey, nine lives, save me. We might not be getting a good score, because I technically just died. I don't think it counts. Thinking bees out. I am nearly dead again already. Yeah, if your armor is not good at defending against this guy, he will ruin your day. Yeah, and I'm wearing electric armor right now, so his terror damage is just ruining me. But my electric hammer is just ruining him, so. Okay, I can't even get to stabbing him because people are just Breaking knocking him, too him over. Quickly. Well, he's almost dead. And Almost completely dead? Oh, I guess he is. And he's dead. Well, that was... That and was that's quick. That. <laughs> Next bonus. Or last bonus. Next bonus, okay. I... S Darn it, I still don't see that. The, the one. Uh... Ooh, I'm taking that. That one. Alchemist's Bulwark. It refills my flask, which is the healing one, and it gains the effects of Bulwark Tonic. Which is just the best potion in the yeah. game. So my armor's great here, but my weapon is not. Oh, and he, these guys have weak points. Great. Get his back leg. I am just missing left, right, and side. So we're focusing Dude, on I am this just guy wounding he's... literally every single part of his body. Both of his legs and his head are wounded. <laughs> no, 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 come back. Come on. I'm running out of stamina trying to get to where he is. Okay, well, that attack just didn't hit me. Stand we're still. Just pretend that didn't happen. Now that's, the, that's the game, not me. Take it down. Up. Oh. Well, that was a little wasted. Let's try this again. Okay, I've wounded his his weak point leg. Yeah, I do more damage Just against, hit him. against weak points, so... Like, really hard. In that weak point leg. Attempting to get a shot in. Well, I got a shot I in. I broke it. I broke it. Or someone did, but I'm, I think it was me. I probably helped. I think I hit that leg by accident. Ow, I was Going not able to dodge him. the badness. Oh, watch out. This guy's getting ready to hit. Here he goes. Got him. Ah, Get them the in the badness. leg. It's dead. All right, he's dead. But so am I almost because the Drask shot me twice with his particle his... beam. Ouch. Yeah. Come on. Ow. Buff wound damage. Let's buff get him. Health bar. Well, that worked out in my favor somehow. I'm wounding something on him. I don't usually give the game uh, some leeway, but it definitely should have hit me there. <laughs> the enemy I just wounded his tail. basically remove it. Oh, I it just goes. removed it. There we go. I can't move this guy standing in front of me. I still think they should remove player collisions from this game. Uh, yeah, player collision might be a good idea to remove, but no, eh, oh, well. 
No, okay, maybe you have to do something else in order or to... Maybe, or maybe we just need to do a harder fire. version. Yeah. Because we're doing a 1 to 13, and I hear that the creature up at the top is higher than 13, so... That might, that might be it. Who knows? It's not me. I don't know. Also, before this started, I just picked up a new bounty to deal, like, 125,000 wound damage, and I did it. <laughs> nice. Or was it 125? I think that's oh, it more than it was. Okay, no, it was 12.5 thousand. But still, I did it in one mission. I did Man, if you just need creature 000. parts in general, this is the thing to do, because you just get a little bit of everything. You get a little bit of this, a little bit of that, a little bit of that too. It's just whatever pieces you need, you, you got some. And I got another uh, talent point, so I'm going to go hand that in. Okay. Torrent shield or amp upgrade. Uh, torrent shield looks like a good idea. And now I have access to the second level. So I guess if I put in 25 levels, then I get the lightning escalation cosmetics, which look really nice. I gotta say, looking real nice. I'll probably upgrade Mender's Gift is what I'll upgrade next. Taking damage, or maybe Breath of Life. It's one of the two. So we can do that again, or we can do something like that's on one of you guys' missions. I know that my missions are all like, do escalations and do heroic bounties, but I, well, I've never even gotten close to finishing a heroic bounty, so. I know Frank has somehow completed like two or three of them, which I'm just dumbfounded. Like, how? How do you even do that? You're you're just you're magic. It's got to be magic. Oh, that's nice. That looks nice. It's very expensive, though. Goodness, you could buy the hunt pass for that much. Sorry, what? I was looking I was looking in the shop, there's a cosmetic, which doesn't look half bad, but you could buy the entire hunt pass and a fifth for the same price. So don't think so. So I've got a mission where I, I need to use axes, but I also still need to do I got the pick up the exact same mission I finished last time, which is deal twelve point five thousand part damage. Well, or then, sorry, wound damage. Then let's just do the same damage. thing all over again. Why not? But see here's the thing. I need to use an axe. An axe is deal mostly part damage. Yeah. I remember we so would use part life. we would use axes and hammers whenever we needed uh, creature parts. But here's how I fixed that. I have gotten acidic and it converts 50% of my part damage into wound damage. Ah, smart. Smart strats over here. So now I'm going to be dealing 50-50 damage with an axe. That's not bad. You're still dealing the whole damage. The whole damage. <laughs> Everything and the damage. I mean, you're not wrong, I'm dealing the whole damage. The whole damage, all the damage, and nothing but the damage. So I have, uh, I've actually maxed out the armor usage on 9 of the 20 behemoths now. And most of the behemoths, I'm only like 1 or 2 battles from finishing. Except the Volamir, which I haven't even gotten one on because the Volamir sucks. <laughs> I hate fighting that so much. Maybe they've changed it since I last fought it? No. <laughs> okay, well I guess they haven't. 
Is it, the Valamir's that the laser thing, the, yeah. The, the laser rhino. Yeah, the laser rhino. Yeah, that's the one that is sometimes invincible, I think. Yeah. yeah. Well, actually, no. Not really invincible. Like he just he teleports around the place and then he spawns orbs that have no like no discernible hitbox, hit, but yeah. they still kill you very quickly. Well, it's not about the hitbox, it's about the fact that they have no hit like cooldown. You know when you're hit by an attack oh, sometimes yeah, you can yeah, yeah, hit yeah. twice in a row? Yeah, well it spawns like 30 orbs or more than that sometimes all around it. And there's no like hit cooldown timer. You just get hit by eight of them in a row. And it still stuns you. It's just like now you can't do anything about it. Hmm. Yeah, that, that sounds like fun. That's why I don't have very good radiant armor or radiant weapons. I don't either because I hate it. I hate everything about it. I would prefer not to be on fire, actually. Who would have guessed? Ow. Well, but now I'm on the right me. side to hit his leg, so that's something, I guess. That's cool. I'm not. <laughs> I'm just gonna hit his tail. Well, there, no, goes, there goes his tail. His tail. <laughs> oh, also, because I'm... of... Because of my damage that's converted to wound damage, I was actually able to wound his tail with an axe. Nice. Which is not something you're supposed to be able Ow. to do. Because it hurts. If I'm correct, axes... the axe does not normally deal wound damage. Yeah, well, actually, it does. Every be... I'm, I'm almost certain that every weapon type deals every damage type. It's just like, if it's in too small of an amount, it won't show. Yeah. Well, I know that my part damage goes down to forty, so it at least shows you how much damage you're doing down to forty. Yeah, well, actually, that might just because you're using a hammer. It shows me damage only up to, a, like, 100. It won't show me anything lower than 100. Oh. Yeah, maybe. Nope, no. Well, oh, he's, dead. he's dead. We got S. I'm pretty sure that the thing we're missing here is that you need to have a, a higher escalation mission. Because yeah, why would probably. there be a menu for escalation missions if that wasn't the case? It just seems like they'd add more at some point, so. Oh, okay, so we got an easy boy and a medium boy. And I immediately Oop. got knocked over. Oh, okay. Take down the Embermane first. Yes, because he is the speedy. Just execute him. We got two speedy slidey boys. Ow. I don't like any of them. Okay, Embermane's down. Knock him down. I am dealing upwards of 600 wound damage. <laughs> What is he doing? Hey, stop it. Well, you said, hey, stop it, and he did. No, and he's too far away for me to hit. I really do not like that about them. Mm, hey, stop it. Oh, really? He didn't attack me, so I missed. Yep, same. Oof, that was a lot of hits in a row. Oop. All right, he's even more angry. Mm, he Ow. can be angry all he wants. Just because he's some Got angry him. jerk doesn't give him the right to... Well, I, I don't really know, man. I just love fighting Embermanes. They're so easy. Embermanes, it really... I, I, okay. Obviously, you wouldn't have seen it, but what just happened there was I was too good at charging my axe, and he moved through me, and I wasn't able to hit him. Darn it. Happens a lot. Both of these guys are very close to going down. Excellent, it means we deal more damage. Oh, because you grabbed that. Well, that one's oh, dead. Well, there goes my axe. I need to, I actually and need to- And there goes that one. Oh wait, I'm still getting charge off of it. No, I need to hit it. I need to hit it. Yes! <laughs> Apparently what? hitting his corpse gives me axe energy. Nice. Uh, oh. Pact of Vitality, sure. 
Pack to Vitality. It seems to be bad at the start, then good if you actually win. I'm Squad that, goal. It, it's description is too long for me to bother reading in the heat of battle, so... I'll have to read it after hey, this. I need to throw this thing. Yeet. So did anyone read the, what these crystals do? Because I didn't. Uh, it says lightning stars. I'm going to assume it does lightning damage. So yeah, after a lot of field research, we'll say, uh, the nine lives definitely just makes you invulnerable 20% of the time if you have level six. Sounds a bit unintentionally broken. Yeah, it okay. does. But it's only 20% of the time even with max level, so I guess it's balanced. Oh, did I knock him over? Okay, Possibly. I didn't really mean to do that. No, I did knock him over. I just didn't mean to. Well, I mean, he like, sort of actually walked into my axe. Yeah, I've had that happen with a few of these guys before. Guys, try to remove his tail. Let's get rid of it. We, we don't need that in our lives. Like, see this? Just remove it. <laughs> like that? Yeah. Like, exactly like that. Literally that exact thing. There he goes. I'm gonna dig. Bad, bad, never mind. I'm gonna smash. Oh, he's dead. Oh, and he's dead. Oh, hey, here comes all the things. Oh, no. Charging up. And... Bulwark Tonic, yes, please. Even though I haven't used a single health tonic, I will take that because Bulwark Tonic is awesome. Ah! Uh, like are you mm, kidding hey. me? Who do we take out first? The bad one. I'm gonna try and help you with that. I didn't I know they can get miss. stuck. And where'd he go? Well, that's where he went. He went over there. Health. How? Definitely gonna need health top up now. Mm, can't uh, even hit him. He keeps running away. Stop! He is <laughs> too fast. We really have to kill the more dangerous one first. Because yep. sure, the less dangerous one is less dangerous and easier to kill. But guess what? But guess what? The other one's Ow. gonna get in the way. I I have not dealt a single bit of damage so far. I, I, I don't think I, I ever will. It. You know, honestly, yeah. I think throughout this fight, I might just not ever hit anything. And other people are going to have to deal with it. Because he doesn't sit still long enough for me to even charge my axe. Like, there, I just got to charge, and he just moved. Oh, he's either charged. Watch out, this guy's going to move way faster now. He's already moving too fast. Is this the heroic variant? Because I don't think I've fought this one before. Yeah, this is it. Oh, this is the heroic variant? No wonder. And I'm and I just remembered I'm wearing electric armor of all things. And I broke his face. That's good, but we need to break his arms. Break his legs, Tony. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so the other two guys are doing pretty good taking out. Well, my broke is something. I don't even really know what it was. Take those things off his arms. Uh, take that thing off his head. His head. Hit him in the head. Do my best. He's invisible Got a now. Yeet. Yeah, good job. Okay, again, focus on his arms. I think his arms are broken. Uh, yeah, but he's still got those fins on, which means he's still either charged. Ow! Uh, my health bar. Where did he go? There he is. He's right here. Oh, no, no, his arms are not broken. Well, he's, okay, dead, he's dead, so I guess it doesn't really matter. Is that it? That might have been yeah, it. Yeah, that's it. That was quick. I'm using all my health potions again. We are but like, hey. really good at that. This gives Whew. us so much rams. I don't think I've ever actually needed rams. Or no, I've, I've never been run. out of rams, so I don't, I don't exactly know what the point is. I guess, can you buy ingredients? Like, look at that, 1,240 rams. I don't know what, 
when the last time I spent that many rams was. Yeah, that, that wasp thing is a Karabakh, which I think that was the heroic variant, so even scarier. Or, well, not heroic, actually. It would have just no? been like the. It was just the dire no, version. It wasn't heroic. Yeah, it was like the the angrier version. There's regular, dire, and heroic. Those are the, those are the three flavors of death. Got one more talent point, uh, so let's put it into amp upgrade. Makes sense. So in one more uh, point, I'll actually, well, I won't finish a quest, but I'll be mostly finished a quest. Yeah, uh, the reason you didn't see us kill the secondary monster was because that was on Frank's screen with the other guy, uh, while me and Radish were focusing on the other big guy, the arguably more dangerous one. I don't know. It, I know that it was can, definitely the more dangerous one. You I'm can just not sure. Yeah. <laughs> How would you like to die, sir? Regular, dire, or heroic? <laughs> uh, chat's funny. What time is it? We got time for. We might just barely be able to squeeze another. Uh, another. Uh... Yeah, do it. Okay. You guys know what I'm talking about. Let's squeeze one more out of this episode. Hopefully we don't go uh, overtime, but this is MMO Mondays. We pretty much always go overtime because I keep forgetting to set my timer. I made the timer specifically for MMO Mondays and then forget to use it. Oops. I'm just running in the circle. What the? What the? I keep getting teleported. <laughs> Maybe I'm running too fast. Now the monsters will see the most powerful weapon, the most powerful melee weapon of all. Hammers. It's not a melee weapon, it's gun. <laughs> Prepare to meet the most powerful weapon of all. Gun! <laughs> okay. I really wish I could upgrade my armor, but all my armor is level 7, and I can't upgrade any more of my armor until I do some heroics. Oh no, <laughs> I don't, I don't want no. to, I don't want to do any heroics, but that's literally all of my quests. One of my quests is do five heroic patrols, just in general. Another one of them is kill these three heroics, which are the only ones I can go after specifically. And the other one is build your armor to level eight slash nine. It's like, come on, really? Do, do, do I have to? Do, do I have to do that? Really? Yeah. Yes. No. No. Yes, we got 12 minutes. Oh, no. <laughs> Let's hope we don't run into any electrics, because if we do, I'm going to not do as much damage. Man, I love that outfit. Let's go. Okay, so we got bombers coming in, but that's fine. It's a Charog again. Aha! The most powerful weapon. And he doesn't gun. have he doesn't have a weak point this time, so we can just smack him anywhere. Gun beats Charog. Uh, I have a problem. I can't shoot. That's not good. Are you it's just? A problem. Are you sure you're not just out of ammo? No, I'm, I'm very sure. I'm very sure that I just can't shoot. That's not I good. I can't use any of my abilities. Uh-oh. Uh, I can't even drink potions. We'll see I can you... take out, put away, and reload my guns, and that is currently all I can do. Okay, you Here, keep, guys. You uh, I, I, I was going to give you a buff, but uh, I'm just going to try to die, see if that fixes it. I'm going to try to go down. I need these guys to explode and deal damage to me, but they don't. Charog, can you kill me, please? He's a little preoccupied getting absolutely beat to bits. Yeah, he is, but I need him to not, because if this isn't fixed by the next monster, it's going to be a problem. I need him to not be dead for, like... Well, I was about to say, I think he did. No, he's, he's not. 
Now he's well, dead. Well, now he's dead. Oh, now he died. Nobody heal me, please. You can jump off a cliff. Try that. That will not. Actually, hold on. Maybe I can just go to help. My character is stuck. This fixed nothing. <laughs> now, now I'm further away and can no longer put away my weapons. Hmm. Well, there's going to be two enemies in the next area, so you can try getting killed by that. Sounds like a plan. What can I grab here? Oh, I can't grab anything either. Oh, well, does that mean the, the, the rocket bit doesn't come up? Uh, no, I okay, can Okay, you can't here. here. It's just you have I to can, forfeit your... I just can't interact with anything. That is strange. Okay, oh, well, we got me, this guy. But that thing might... Hey, something kill me. Anything. I'm standing right here. It should not be hard to kill me. He missed. <laughs> I guess he wasn't aiming for you. He missed as well. Why is it that when I want to die, it's the hardest thing to do? <laughs> I don't know. I'm taking out this thing, though, because no. I hate it. I hate the Boreas so much. Please attack me. Yes, do the... No, someone stunned him. <laughs> Also, it turns Guys, out please. that the blunt damage of a hammer can actually break through this armor. You don't need to get the... I'm very damage. close to death. Yes, victory. Okay, I got medic. I'm coming to get you. I'm a little stuck. <laughs> Give me a second. Okay, here I come. Get up, soldier. Can I shoot now? No. <laughs> well, that's not good. That's not good at all. Try unplugging and plugging your mouse back in again? No, my mouse is fine. It reacts to all the inputs normally. It's just the gun. The, the game is broken. It's just the, the, the gun. The gun itself isn't working. Yeah. Unfortunately, Montana, yes, it would be a good idea to grab the, uh, the, the frag grenades. But one, he can't interact with his potions, which is where the frag grenades are stored. And I'm pretty sure he didn't bring frag grenades anyways. No, I didn't bring any frag grenades. Yeah, you know, you're not usually the guy who brings frag grenades. No, I, I find potions are much better, for the most part. See, I don't Actually, use potions, so potions and frag grenades are equally meh for me. So I just bring them because that's what you do. Well, we'll try and take these guys down as fast as possible. Yeah, I can't even use my buffs or abilities or anything. I can reload, though. You can reload. I can reload. Gun. You just can't fire it. Or aim it. <laughs> okay, well, me not trying has actually accentuated a problem I've had where you can get hit multiple times and be stunlocked. I'm currently stunlocked by these tiny things. Well, I can no longer reload my guns. That's not great. Not that it, not that it matters. Well, it is, one, a free game, and two, pretty sure it's still in development, so, yeah. We can give it a little leeway for some glitchiness. It's fine, it's fine. We're definitely going overtime, though. Because we're only on the second fight, and there's four fights. And it's probably because I can't do anything. <laughs> you know, when there's the difficulty of having four players... When the difficulty setting is like, you have four players, but there's only actually three of them. Yeah. Yeah, and now we're fighting Kosha, which is never an easy fight. But hey, I'm using an electric weapon, so he's... He's not great against it. Unfortunately, I'm wearing electric armor, so I'm not great against that. And I took a buff. Well, it won't be a buff until the next battle. But I took a buff, which makes me take 20% more damage. But next fight, I do 20% more damage, so if we survive... Where did he go? Oh, there he is. Oof, yeah, this is not going to be great. Sorry uh, for everyone who is on a tight schedule that we're going to go overtime. Um, oops. I 
didn't expect this to happen, but I guess it was meant to happen. Getting healed. Wow. Oh. Okay, I need break parts from this thing, too, but I can't break parts off too. Of <laughs> yeah. Oh, I nearly, I nearly hey. accidentally. You know what I guy. can do though? You know what I can do? Dodging through an attack from this guy will give you guys a damage buff now, because I picked up one of them things. Ah, so like, you were able to interact with it. So, yeah, no, I wasn't able to pick things up in the first round. But you Going down second. appears to have... Well, I don't really know. So it, it fixed one thing, but... Nah. I'm, I'm not even able to dodge through an attack because he's just not attacking me. He realizes he you can't hurt him. <laughs> wow. Ow. He's not, he's not doing any telegraphed attacks on me. Oh, I just did it. Hey, everyone gets a damage buff. Two seconds. I'm I coming. can revive Colton. That's good. Double healing. Boom, there you go. Where did he go? Right beside oh. us. That's nice. Hello. Are you still trying your guns? No. I can hold them, but they don't do anything. So I, I'm gonna reload and then put them away. Because I move slower with them out, so. Yeah. Well, just every now and then try and see if they work. They might not, but eh, might as well try. Well, I've been trying to see if they, they work. They, they don't. Don't mind me grabbing them break parts. <laughs> Just... Don't mind me just picking up the scraps. Yep. This is the third fight. Yep, we still have one more fight after this, and it's a twofer. Oh no. And knowing how the last three... Yeah, knowing how the last three have gone, it's probably going to be electric. Oh, I went down. Not that I could do anything about that myself. Let's see if this fixes it. No. Well, no since, since, the, since the first time I went down, the uh, my uh, healing tonic is no longer there. It, it just shows the revive syringe. Oh, yeah, yeah so you're yeah. real broken. Oh, I'm more than just a little bit broken. I, I can see my health bar, but I don't actually know what it's at because it <laughs> doesn't change. Wow, that's like it, super broke. It doesn't broke. change. Hey, squad goals. Hey. Oh, I'll get squad goals just because that'll help you with your squad goals. Hangar and a Shrike. That's easy. Hello, enemies. Oh, I need to reload. Okay, I gave everyone a damage buff by dodging through an attack. That's about all I can really do. Well, I gave myself a damage buff just by surviving the last round. I am out of health tonics. I hope someone around here is a medic, because I'm probably going to die. I'm not, but, I mean, I can still revive you. Yeah. Hello. Do they weaken these guys for these fights? Because I fought a lot of Pangars over the last, like, weekend, so... They shouldn't... Um, no, no. Uh, Frank and I fought a Pangar, just the two of us, uh, like, the other night or something, and it went down real easy. Okay. Because this seems it's, like it's, it's going way no, too well. It's the harder versions that we have trouble with, like the Frostback Pangars. Yeah, I know, but I was Those... only fighting the normal versions over the last week. Uh, no, they're not usually tough. Hmm. Hey guys, I got a bounty complete for slaying eight behemoths. You didn't do anything. <laughs> it's like, my work here is done, but you didn't do anything. Exactly. 
Attack me, fool. Ha! Damage buff for everyone who was within 10 meters of me. Which was maybe me? It doesn't matter. Someone. So we'll definitely have to jump straight to the uh, verse of the day after this. Well, I didn't stun him, but... Man, this I is actually stunning. working. There, I just did it again. Nice. I can see the damage numbers increasing. Like, you go from dealing about 1,100 to about 1,400. Come and get me. Whoop, not like that. Well, that <laughs> worked. <laughs> Just shot it. Just gun. <laughs> More like just particle beam laser. Gun, but on hand. Wouldn't that be a can I collect handgun? the rewards? <laughs> yep, sure can. I can collect rewards for there. There we go. Oh. Bunch of rams. What do we even use these for? <laughs> well, I mean, they technically use them for everything, but. Yeah, but in very low amounts. <laughs> okay, there we go. So that's that's that fight. Uh, time to go straight into the next part of live stream, and I've now muted the computer. So, I don't know if they can still hear you, but I know I won't in a moment, because now you're muted on my end. So, as always, the verse of the week is provided by the Uversion Battle Life for iOS, and for iOS and Android. Hold on, let me just take a drink of mine. Okay, and close chat so I can actually see my notes. So today's verse, put on the full armor of God, Ephesians 6.11 of the New International Version. So I picked this verse not because it was today's verse, because it wasn't, but because I actually thought it would fit with the game we're playing a lot. I didn't switch any armor sets today, but that's just, well I did at the beginning. But the whole verse is actually, put on the full armor of God so that you can take your stand against the devil's schemes. So I may be missing some depth to this verse, but I think it's an easy one as it can be interpreted directly. We need to put on God's armor, I'll go back to that in a moment, just give me a second, in order to be able to stand against the schemes that Satan will use to defeat us. So imagine in our game, if we went to fight a beast with none of our armor. That would be quite foolish, but we go into our day in the real life, each day generally without the armor that God has given us. So what sort of fool are we? And on the armor, what is the armor? Well, here it is. We got the belt of truth. We need to begin with truth, and God is the only source of truth, it is the truth which then holds together everything else. Next up, we have the breastplate of righteousness. We need to seek to do what is right, not what is convenient or feels good. The shoes of the gospel of peace. To walk in the footsteps of Jesus, footsteps of love, not war. The helmet of salvation, to fix our hope on God's plan to save us from our sin. The shield of faith it is our trust in God which shields us in life. We live by faith, meaning we trust and follow. And... Uh, lastly, the sword of the spirit. This is God's word, which we need to read so that we know, so that we know it and can use it. It's great that the Bible is so easy to access with today's internet, but the knowledge in it isn't like an encyclopedia. In, uh, sorry, encyclopedia. You may not need to have every detail memorized, but you do need to know it to be able to know what is true and right and what is not. If you don't read the Bible, you're engineering a, the battle, you're, get, you're entering a battle without a weapon. So picture me in Dauntless without my fancy armor and without a weapon, just, you know, like t-shirt, shorts, and a keyboard. <laughs> how, how long would I last against those truck-sized behemoths? It's, it is your choice how you go through life each day. But it's a battle in the world today, and if you think it isn't, then Satan's schemes have really already won. Pick up your armor this week and head into battle with me. So, that is today's verse. I hope you all enjoyed. We'll be, we'll actually not be playing Slime Rancher 
uh, this Saturday because it is the 1st of February. And you know what the first Saturday of the month means. It means we're playing a sidestep. I've just got to make sure that the game we're going to play works. I know that the game works on my computer. I just don't know if I can actually stream it. So I'm going to go check that out in a few minutes. And I hope you all enjoy. Have a good day. Have a good week. God bless and goodbye. I'll see you all next time. Bye.